Sniper Jackson will be doing a video with my friend Austin. Asa, dude. <laughs> and we're gonna be doing a knife, paper knife tutorial. This is what it should look like. No, but this is my friend's first try, and I did it three times, and it came out worse than this. So the first step we're gonna do is we're gonna do a block. And make sure it's even as possible. Because yeah. the more even it will look, the nicer it'll look like because see this this is pretty even. Instead of just, it was just, not the, even just at bad all. cutting. Yeah. And there's a lot of duct tape, but we're not gonna be using duct tape, we'll be using scotch sketchers. tape, clear tape, um, icky sketchers. Well yeah, back to the video. So after you fold it once, like this, you're gonna fold it again. <laughs> you're gonna fold it again. And I'd recommend using your nail for this yeah. because it just makes it like more flat. Like, see, I don't like that. Yeah, I use your use magical your nail. nail. Yay. It just makes it look really flat and nice. After you do this, you're gonna do it one more time. So we'll be folding it, I think, three times? No, Austin, we're doing it six times. Yes, Austin, three times. I was thinking how many times you do. I can't fold. I can't fold. Damn, close enough. This is probably going to come out really, really bad. Alright, so this is the first thing you're gonna need. Then you're gonna take tape. You don't need that much. You always need this. Okay, you have to buy me more tape then. Hey, I already used a ton of duct tape today. <laughs> I should have made a video on that. <laughs> I cut the edges off and just save it. Scotch tape is like 20. Okay. Alright, we'll be we'll be right back with scissors. Okay guys, we're back. I'll make scissors. Biggest scissors on the planet right here. We had to find them, it took a um, little bit to find them. It took us like two seconds. <laughs> To be honest, it's a, it's a it's two seconds of my life wasted trying to find scissors. Oh God, I can't cut it. Right so after you cut this, it's supposed to be like this. And when you're doing, shut up. When you're doing this part, you're gonna want to have the tape on the top, not on the bottom. Because <laughs> if you do it on the bottom, it's gonna like if you want to color it or something, it's gonna be a lot worse. So what you're gonna do is you're just gonna take this and you go go like this and you're gonna cut it so it has like a little sharp edge like that, not really sharp, you know, I have a terrible cutter. Like if you want, you can give it like a little like mountain. And then you're gonna go like this for uh right there. And then you just Close enough. That's the first part, and then. Okay. Oh. 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 Okay. So then you're gonna make a little, little cuts like these, and make four of them. For like a saw. Oh, for like a like, saw. Okay, ready? I'm gonna do it. This is gonna be so bad. Of course you're zooming. I can't cut. You're just gonna cut at like an angle kind of. So I cut at an angle and then this. cut at another, another angle but See, there, match there, it there, like there, that there, kind there, there of. One. Just don't make it look like a shark fin. <laughs> I'm sorry. I hate you. <laughs> Worst, okay, don't, don't. don't film play, stuff don't yourself. Don't play with scissors, kids. Yeah. Unless you want stitches. Say, hey, stitches stuck. Yeah, they do. 
Yeah, you guys can tell one's definitely bigger than the other. Okay, I suck at it, Wait, but go back. Just brand new knife here. Yeah, I can tell Austin. Yes, Austin, you're zooming in. I get it. Okay. I'm gonna make four. You can make as many as you want. It doesn't matter. I I just wouldn't recommend going all the way down the knife. It would look kind of dumb. We taught it. I suck at cutting Austin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this one's definitely gonna be like the biggest one. I can also be like the smallest one. Boom. Okay. Close enough. Okay, All right. Guys, so, so this is the first. Part of and it. And now we are gonna take a quick break. Cause it took hours. And yeah. It took us six minutes, but okay. Okay. Alright, we're right back. Okay, guys, we're back. Um, um, we also give full credit to Crazy Tutorials for this knife. Cause he's the one that made it. Yeah. So. But next, you will grab a pencil or, and or start pen. from the corner and like roll up. And then you'll need to have your tape, and then just tape the little flap. You shouldn't have to use as much tape, because you don't need a lot. Whatever. Okay. I dropped, I dropped the pencil. We honestly might need four pieces. No, we don't. You just want to do one? Yeah. Alright, so, then you're going to take this part. And you're going to push down and up. So it should go like this. It should look like a little hole. Yes, like this. Go on in see. there. And then you're going to put the thing. Put in. the rod thing in the hole. Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. <laughs> Alright, so right oh, yeah. there should be about good. And then I'm going to take a magical tape. You're just, he's just going to cut it randomly. It, it, it all depends on how big you want it. Yeah, so this is... I'd recommend making like the size of your hand. Maybe a little bit bigger than the size of Just your hand. Just make it however big you want. And then... And then you're going to... Put that pin. Give me the pin. You're going to yeah. mark it. Mark it, so like line it up. As you can see, he's like, that's the end of the pencil. End of the handle. And so that's how long the handle's going to be from... Let me just from that line to the end of the paper. So and probably about cut it. three and a half inches. But ours is gonna be different. Our handle is gonna be a different size than yours, so. I'm gonna cut the magic. Boom. That should be done. And then I'm just gonna line it up like this. I'm gonna roll it, I'm gonna roll it. And then he's gonna roll the paper he cut out on the little a uh, stick, I guess. A little rod. Yeah, the, the rod. Just roll the paper up. Like. Still don't work with this. Yeah, I'd recommend taking it out. Um, just because it is kind of hard, hold like holding it. Like, just because what you're holding is is like a small little area, but. This is gonna make it easier, a lot easier, because the knife affects it from rolling. Right there. And he's gonna push forward, maybe. Oh, I guess I doesn't wanna do it. And then you can grab some tape. Oh, I think I went too far. Right there, wait, Austin. Okay, now this is when the knife comes in handy. Yeah, and then you grab the knife. And you put it push it. the knife I'm gonna push, like, the against there. it. I'm gonna put magical tape. And then you put tape on it. But make sure that your um your knife is uh pushed against the handle so it bears support. Alright, yeah, so I'm gonna need another piece too. I forget to see. Oh yeah. Alright. 
this is actually probably one of the better knives that we've done. Alright, so then you're just gonna connect the pieces. Maybe, if I'm smart. But I recommend if you like want to 